What's up, card maniacs? Do you like Pokemon cards? And do you like shiny Pokemon? If you answered yes to both of those questions, then you might be excited for this new set. Shiny Treasure EX has officially been revealed. Now this set will be releasing in Japan on December 1st and it will include 190 cards before Secret Rares. The set will have a ton of shiny Pokemon as Secret Rares. All of them are reprints from last year but with alternate shiny artwork. This is typical of past shiny sets like VMAX Climax and Shiny Star V. Now let's take a look at some of these cards and artwork. So here is the pack art. Take a look at that. Got some really cool shiny Pokemon on it. But of course, Charizard has to steal the spotlight. He's glowing back there. He's like, I am the alpha. I am the best Pokemon ever created. The Pokemon company said so. Because they release 30 cards of me every year. And it's going to be crazy if the Charizard is the chase in this set. Because he's literally been the chase and literally this will be the third set recently. I mean, we've got um, 151 Charizard is the best card in the chase. Then we've got Obsidian Flames. We've got four Charizards. And the SIR is the best card in the set. And then this, most likely the Charizard is going to be the most pricey card and the best card in the set. But we will see. So then we have the uh, Sprigatito. We also have the Florigato. That's a pretty cool artwork right there. Now I really am digging these like yellow gold stars that they're putting in there. That's pretty, pretty cool. Now we have the Meowscarada. You know, I wasn't really a fan of Meowscarada at first, but... Now it's grown on me a good bit. I do like it. It's definitely the second best Paldea starter in my opinion. But this is the first in my opinion. Foy Coco. Look at that little guy. Then we have a Crocolore. He looks mean. And a Skeledurge. Super sick card. And I'm loving the color. Like kind of like a pinkish color. Super, super, super awesome. Then we have the Quaxley right here, and the Quaxwell, looking like he or she is doing ballet here. Interesting. And then we have the Quaquable. Now I do really like the white background on these cards, and if you notice, it kind of has like a swirl going on in the background, so that's pretty cool. I mean, not, not bad. I, I do like it. And I do love shiny Pokemon, and I'm sure we all do, right? Now here is the big boy, the Charizard EX, with the same artwork from Obsidian Flames as the Ultra Rare Full Art, but this one is shiny, as you can tell. Now, I'm not too angry about this, because honestly, I don't even have any Charizard cards that are shiny, uh, except for the Crown Zenith Radiant Charizard. I don't even have the Pokemon Go Radiant Charizard because I started collecting kind of late, but I'm interested to hear your thoughts about this card because a lot of people are upset, a lot of people think it's ugly, and they are just tired of these arts. Then we have some more cards that have been shown right here. We have the Backscalibur in the back. We have a really cool looking Charmander, like a goldish yellow color. That's really, really neat. We even have a little Wooper in the background and a Ralts. Then there's a couple other Pokemon. I honestly, I can't, I can't squint that hard. I can't tell what exactly those are, but if you zoom in on it, you might be able to find out. Let me know in the comments if you find out what Pokemon those are. Now, Shiny Treasure EX will feature a high number of secret rare cards. For example, Shiny Charizard EX will be card number 331190. Thus, we can safely assume there will be over 150 secret rare cards in this set, which is absolutely insane. 
Shiny Star V featured 190 cards in its main set and 140 secret rares for a total of 330 cards. Shiny Treasure EX is Japan's annual reprint set, so it will mostly contain reprinted cards in its main set and maybe 15 to 30 brand new cards. These reprint sets help ensure cards from the last year are available to Japanese players and collectors. So that's pretty interesting, honestly. That's pretty cool. I didn't know that, so that's pretty neat. And I, I, I'm not complaining, hey. And so far, just one of the new cards have been revealed, and that is a trainer card, Clive. Let's take a look at it. Now, this is a cool guy. Now, that is a cool Mama Jamma right there. I wish I was as cool as this guy. Check him out. He's got the Johnny Bravo hair. I mean, whoo, and those shades and that everything about him. He is fly. He is fly, boy. So let's go ahead and read this supporter card. Your opponent reveals their hand. Draw two cards for each supporter card you find there. You may play only one supporter card during your turn. So I don't know. Maybe that could be good. Maybe, maybe against like a Lost Zone deck or something like that that has a lot of cards in their hand coming to the end of the game. Uh, I'm not too sure if it'll really be playable though. Uh, let me know what you think about it though. Now, these sets also feature card arts that were released first in English. This is usually how Japan receives promos we get throughout the year in our special boxes and pre-release kits. As with all high class sets, each shiny treasure EX booster pack will come with 10 cards. Each booster pack will also come with a guaranteed Pokemon EX. We expect shiny treasure EX will become part of our unnamed Scarlet and Violet 4.5 set in January. So that's pretty cool. I think our last high class set was V-Star Universe. Which I did have a lot of fun opening. Uh, that was back in December when I first started making content. And first started getting back into collecting. And it was a ton of fun to open. I really do like these high class sets. Because like, like, like it says, you're guaranteed something good. And a lot of those packs have like, what, two and three hits in them? Which is pretty sweet. Um, the V-Star Universe was like $120 back then though for like a small $10 box, or 10, sorry, 10 pack box. So, I don't know, maybe this set will be pricey too at first, but um, we'll just, we'll just have to see, right? And I definitely can't wait for it to come out in English because that is going to be awesome. Thank you so much for watching the video. Go ahead and hit that like button for me. Drop a comment down below. Let me know what you think about this set. Are you excited for it? Let me know which card is your favorite of the cards that I've revealed so far. Let me know also what do you think about this Charizard card. I'm dying to hear your opinion on it because I've heard a lot of hate so far on this card and a lot of of people say it's ugly so I want to know what you think about it let me know down in the comments also subscribe to the channel with notifications on we will keep you up to date on everything Pokemon TCG news related and we'll have plenty more Pokemon card openings coming very very soon thank you so much once again for watching and have a wonderful day